YouTube. Hey everybody, I'm back in Mount Dora, back on the bike trail. Um, I told you in the last video there'll be a part two to this, so I just want to do that. And uh, today I am going to be hitting Mount Dora Bike Park um, on the trail that I missed last time. Um, seriously doubt if I'm going to be doing the Hustle Skelter today. I might, it just depends on the energy that I have, but I just wanted to see the other parts to this trail. And so that's what I plan on doing today. I'm um, not going to make it a long video. I'm trying not to also uh, do anything that I did last time on the video. So it should be kind of a quick short video on the rest of the trail that I wasn't able to see last time. And uh, yeah, so that's about it. Um, today I'm on the GT Avalanche. If you saw the last video, I went to Santos and my pedal fell off on the Nashiki. So I got to wait till the park comes in to get that fixed. So today I'm on the GT. Um, so yeah, I'm excited about it and I'll let you know how it goes at the end of the video. Okay, peace. Shit.
<sighs> okay, YouTube, hey. Just finished my, uh, my ride again on Mount Dora. Second ride, and um, I ended up doing, I think, all the trails on it. Actually, excuse me, I actually did a double loop, I think. I circled around it twice. And so it looks like I pretty much covered all of the park. So I'm not gonna put all of that footage because I I double backed on that on that same the same trails that kind of intertwine and lead up to one another. Um <laughs> I like Mount Dora. I think it's a fun trail. I think it's got some some straightaways that you can go really fast and catch some speed. Not a lot of drops. Um had a lot of surprises. There was an expert part on it that had a very, very steep ramp that even when trying to gain some speed and momentum to go up it, I just couldn't do it. And then once you cross over it, it's another drop, but it's like a straight drop incline. And uh, yeah, I don't know. It looked, it looked a little bit more scary than it probably was. But I didn't see anyone trying it. I didn't see not one person. Everyone that saw that just avoided it. So I got to at least see someone else try it first before I do it. But um, but overall, it was it was a fun time. Extremely hot out here today. Extremely hot and humid. The sun is out. And when that sun comes out, it drains me. Right now, I'm showing 91 degrees. But with the 60% humidity, it feels like 100, 100 degrees. And so, um, only rode for 50 minutes. I tried to go for an hour, but I couldn't. I'm, I'm just exhausted. The Health the Skelter, forget about that. And I can't even, can't even do it, so. And I did eat breakfast this morning, but that energy is not gone. The Florida sun in August, the heat and humidity down here is no joke. It's serious, man. And it gets hotter here in Orlando than like certain parts of South Florida. It's just because we're centralized and we don't have that direct ocean breeze and it just gets very, very hot. So I'm tired. I know I look a little dazed and I am. And so uh, I'm headed home to take a shot. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. Be safe. I'm out. Peace.